welcome to Defining Moments with Governor Russ. You know, I have a friend, uh, she's a local author. Her name is Christine Roberts, and she wrote this uh, book called uh, Inspirational Mind Food. It's really probably one of the greatest small read uh, books that I've ever read. It's simple, I mean, it's short chapters, big letters, uh, but a lot of uh, inspirational information into it. And I know as optimists, you know, sometimes we got to stop and think about everything that's going on. And one of her chapters in it is entitled, uh, It's Not About Me, It's Not About You. And, you know, that goes a long way for an optimist to try and figure out, you know, sometimes we get caught up in so much stuff. And, and we feel like sometimes it's really all about us. But we know in our hearts it's really all about the children. And it's all about the communities that we serve. I think the neat thing about this is that she tells a story in the very first chapter that talks about her driving down the street. One of the busy interstates uh, in Georgia, high just happens to be Highway 400, and she's driving uh, you know, down the road and somebody comes up behind her and they're flashing their lights and they're riding on her tail and you know, she immediately goes into the mindset that, you know, what's this guy doing? He's just trying to bother me. He's just being a terrible person, you know, and, and she, you know, she gets mad at herself and she, she contemplates, you know, maybe I should slow down a little bit. So, so much goes on in just a few seconds. And, uh, but it comes to find out that as soon as the guy gets a chance to get around her safely, he speeds around her and it happens to be the next exit where he gets off. And that exit happens to be a hospital. So can you imagine what was going on in this poor person's mind? He was trying to rush to get to the hospital for some reason that we don't know. But then you have to stop and think. You know, there I was thinking it was a personal attack on me, she thought. And then it come to find out that it wasn't about her and that it was important for them to get to the hospital. So she never knew, you know, what happened, what it was. But it does help you to stop and think about what goes on in your life. And to remember that it's not always about me. It's not always about you. It's about the success and what we accomplish with the children and the communities that we have. So I want you to think about that. And maybe pick up her book, Inspirational Mind Food. Uh, it's a wonderful, well-read book. This is not an advertisement for it, but I pick this book up every now and then when I want to get my mind straight. And uh, I hope that you, uh, you're having a great day. Summer's getting ready to be started. The sun's out. It's getting beautiful. And I can't think of a better time to serve your community. Until next we meet again, be optimistic. And let's bring in a new member. Thank you for everything that you're doing. Without you, we can't do the things we need to. I love you all, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.